material that we developed through these two days of just free improvising turn into you know ideas for songs and just by following that instinct that led us to creating this material that is so much larger than what we started with so i'm interested in that process of starting with a zero point so you don't plan anything and then you see what can you do out of that zero point to make it as large as possible. That fascinates me. Into that wretched place. We've exchanged files, exchanged ideas, and, and it has gradually turned into a band project consisting of songs rather than instrumentals, which is an interesting development as it all started like Jan mentioned as a session of improvised instrumental music. Longest day every color is it just felt like touching the first domino stone. I had this idea of bringing the three of us together and so this was the just a little touch and then suddenly out of this there's this movement and this this flow coming just this feels very beautiful. So it sometimes doesn't need much to bring something to life. So you had a feeling that okay, if we gather there's something happening here and we if we just make the right conditions for it, that something might grow out of that. That's interesting. So that's the sort of the first step. And the second step, I think, was important that we just met on a free basis, recording music, not sort of pre-written material, uh, but just like, okay, you know, meet in a room, see what happens, and have a dialogue musically. And after that, you know, making these constructions mm. uh, involving Eric and so on. Till it Also in the overdub situation, we kept this free improvisational way of uh, doing things. Is it possible to make uh, some kind of music where you use all your knowledge, you know, all, all the 30 years of music making, and put that into a project? Shine as bright as light. Heaven offers